A longtime bakery operation in Luzerne County will close its doors, leaving 157 people out of work. The Bimbo Bakery plant has been a mainstay in that community for nearly 60 years now. The I team's Andy Mahalshik is in the control center with details. Andy, what have you learned tonight? Well, Nick, the Bimbo plant, formerly known as the Stroman Bakery plant, will close in September. Employees reached out to the I team saying they are shocked and angry by all of this. Many in that community are also stunned by the news. It was all of a sudden. We had no idea this was happening. Uh, just all of a sudden, all of a sudden, it happened. And we heard that over and over again Wednesday as word of the impending closing of the Beanbow Bakery in West Hazelton spread throughout the community. Well, we're sad to see that uh, Beanbow Bakeries would be closing Strowman's. Uh, it's a shame to see 157 people put out of work. The plant bakes all types of bread. It opened as part of the Stroman Company in the Valmont Industrial Park back in the 1950s. The company sent a statement to Whitewoods News, which reads in part, Decisions like this are always difficult. After careful analysis and consideration, we determined it is most efficient to redistribute production to other bakeries in our system to better meet market demand. State Senator John Udichak says the Commonwealth is ready to help with employees with career services. Whether it's retraining, whether it's transitioning to a new job, whether it's helping the communities deal with that plant closure, that rapid response team is going to be on the ground there in West Hazleton helping those many families. West Hazleton Mayor John Chura says the plant closing will cost the borough tens of thousands of dollars in real estate and income tax revenue. So hopefully we would hope that somebody else would come in and take over their bakery, which would be a great thing. You know, and also the loss of our revenue for the borough is not good. The plant will be closed sometime in December. An exact date has not yet been released. Reporting in the control center, Andy Mahal, Chicago Witness News. All right, Andy, thanks for the update. And the company says the closure of the West Hazelton plant will not have an impact on consumers as far as product availability is concerned.